Uh, this video will be looking at Harmony's Select Tool. All right, the Select Tool can be found in the very top of the Tools toolbar. Select it. All right, and once you select something, you'll get a selection box very much like any selection box in any other software. So you uh, will have a bounding box with a pivot point in the center around whatever we've selected. And you can uh, manipulate that selection by hovering around the corner. And once you click and grab it, you can now change the height and width of whatever you've selected. You can also skew whatever you've selected by hovering your mouse right over the edge of the bounding box until you get this icon. And now you can skew anything either horizontally or vertically. If you'd like to shrink something proportionally, just hit shift and hold it down on your keyboard. And now anything you've selected will, will shrink or grow proportionally. All right, if you'd like to rotate your selection, hover around one of the corners uh, until you get this kind of circle icon. And now your selection will rotate around that pivot point. And of course you can move that pivot point anywhere and when, when you're rotating, it'll always revolve around that pivot point. Over here in the tool properties are the function modes for the select tool. And to find out more about how they function, simply click help and search select tool in the online help. Over here in operations, you can change the position, size and rotation of whatever you've selected uh, numerically instead of having to do it visually in the camera or drawing view. Over here I can change the thick and thinness of a selected pencil line. So for example if I take the pen tool, draw a line, select it, I can now easily just change its thick and thinness. And that's a quick look at Harmony's select tool.